Okay, how do we combine functions? Like, for example, what if we wanted to add these two functions? Well, that's pretty straightforward that you would just simply take the square root of x and add it to the g of x. And there's no like terms, so nothing you can combine. And then if you're asked to find the domain, well, looking at that square root with the square root of x, it had to be at least 0 and then above so you don't have any negative numbers. All right, what if we wanted to subtract the two functions? The only part you have to be careful here is be sure that you distribute the negative sign. So what I like to do is put this in parentheses. And now I can distribute that negative, and a negative and a negative will be a plus 17. And it looks like my domain has not changed, so still would be 0 to infinity. All right, what if we want to multiply? So in other words, f of g of x. So we're going to take the square root of x times x minus 17. Do you remember somewhere in your brain the square root is the same thing as the one-half power? I hope you remember that. All right, so and x is that's to the first power. So I'm going to distribute this, multiply, and remember when you multiply with the same basis x, you add the exponents. So this x to the one-half times x to the first power, well, let's make that 2 over 2 so I can add those. And then this is just going to be minus 17x to the 1 half. And so I have x to the 1 half plus 2 over 2. Same basis, add the exponents. So I get x to the 3 halves. And then minus 17, and I can write that back as square root of x. Once again, same domain. I just need to be sure my square root is not going to be negative. All right, and then finally, the last, what if we wanted to divide the two functions? Well, we take the f of x up top. We put this on the bottom, and that's pretty much it. There's nothing else we can do. We just have to be sure that Notice our domain up here needs to be 0 or above, and down here can't be 17. So how we would write that for our domain would be we'd start at 0, go all the way up to 17, but do not touch 17, jump to the other side of 17, and then can be anything above that number.